Hey guys, and welcome back to my channel. Today I've got a swatch video of five different polishes from Heroin NYC's fall lineup. This is the first time I'm trying polishes from Heroin NYC, and I was really impressed by the formula of all of these polishes, so I'm really excited to share this video. These five polishes are all part of different collections, but they're all still available individually on the Heroin NYC website. But anyways, let's go ahead and get on into the swatches. So the first polish is Same Old Love, and the reason why I put this one first is because this polish is part of their Breast Cancer Awareness Campaign. So for the entire month of October, which is Breast Cancer Awareness Month, if you purchase any of their pink polishes, including Sugar Spun, Same Old Love, Mean Girl, Bubblegum, or Blush Babe, they will donate 100% of the net profits to the National Breast Cancer Foundation. So I will leave a link down below to their blog post so that you can learn more and learn how you can help. So here are two coats of Same Old Love. The second polish is called Wine at Midnight, which is a dark red cream polish. This one did have a slightly more jelly-like formula compared to Same Old Love, which gave it a really juicy finish, and it was opaque in two coats. So here are two coats of Wine at Midnight. The next polish is called Between the Sheets and this is a pale pink neutral cream polish. The formula on this one was super creamy and similar to Sam Old Love and it swatched in two easy coats. So here are two coats of Same Old Love. The fourth polish is called Rosé All Day and this is a metallic rose gold polish. This one swatched easily in two coats and there weren't any noticeable brush strokes for me, which sometimes happens with metallic or foil polishes, but I really like the look of this one and I even tried this one with stamping and it works. So here are two coats of Rosé All Day. And the final polish that I'm sharing today is Gold Digger, which is a gold holographic glitter polish. And I really like this kind of gold because it's more of a champagne gold rather than a very yellow gold, which I personally prefer. And after the first coat, I thought I might have to sponge it on in order to reach full opacity, but it built up really nicely and was completely opaque in just three coats. This one does dry down kind of matte, which I thought was cool, so I wanted to leave that in there, but I also wanted to show you what this polish looks like with the glossy top coat. I think you can see the holographic a little bit better, and it adds a really pretty glossy shine. So here's one more look at the five polishes that I swatched from Heroin NYC. Again, these polishes are part of a fall color palette, but they're not available as a collection together. They're actually available in different collections, but you can still purchase them individually on their website. And remember, if you purchase Same Old Love or the other four polishes that are part of their breast cancer awareness campaign during the month of October, they will be donating 100% of the net profits to the National Breast Cancer Foundation. Anyways, that's all for today's video. I hope you guys enjoyed watching it, and if you did, please be sure to give this video a thumbs up. And if you're new to my channel, I do swatches, reviews, and nail art tutorials, so be sure to subscribe down below and let me know which of these five polishes was your favorite. Anyways, that's all for today, and I'll see you guys next time. Bye!